Hi guys, welcome to the new video. I just finished watching The Last of Us Season 1 Episode 2 and I wanna share my thoughts what I think about the episode. So, without spoilers, another fucking great episode. I am invested in the story, I like those characters, great acting, great dialogue. We finally see zombies in this one, CGI looks amazing, okay? I'm gonna recreate a couple of scenes from this series and do some tutorials on my channel because this this looks fucking great okay we finally see zombies like i said and they look fucking creepy the sounds everything looks fucking great the music seriously this is fucking one of my favorite zombie <laughs> series and i just watched two episodes already i love this story like i said i never played the games yes but this this is fucking amazing guys this pedro pascal i love his fucking character he is fucking great so yeah 8 out of 10, check it out this stuff. I think another strong episode like the first one. I hope this series is gonna keep up uh, on this, uh, keep this level through the whole fucking series because this is fucking great stuff. Check it out this stuff, like I said, great CGI in this one. And the zombies look fucking scary. I like the twist like they do in the zombies, yes, in this universe. Great fucking stuff, guys. 8 out of 10, okay, I'm gonna jump into the spoiler section. So basically, you watch yes, the episode. The episode starts with the science lady. Yes, she was eating dinner in this fucking restaurant. This old chick. And the police just came and basically she just took, uh, police just took her and uh, to check out the virus, yes. And I'm assuming this is not some kind of virus. This is some kind of mushroom, stupid bullshit. Like, there is no cure, yes, for this disease. And I love this twist, like I said, with the mushrooms, okay? <laughs> you got zombie mushrooms. It's very fucking creative. So basically, you know, police just take her and she was doing some fucking testing, yes? She just looked through the mic microscope and they just talked with another language, yes? And it was great setup already. Yes, great dialogue. Not much CGI at the beginning, yes? And you are already invested, like, holy fuck, this is scientist. This is how this virus basically started, yes? I'll to flashback, the science lady basically was talking like, hey, there is no cure for this. She was fucking checking the leg, yes, of this naked woman. And she just look out on the fucking, how to say, yes, on the mouth. And she just discovered the mushrooms. So fucking disgusting. And she was taking, talking, that, that was fucking surprising. Like, bomb the fucking city. I like this dialogue. You can see when the dialogue is good written, I can remember some fucking pieces. Okay, when the dialogue is shit, I cannot remember stuff. But right here, I remember bomb the fucking city. She just tell yes. She was drinking this tea and she was fucking terrified. And she was like, okay, I want to go to my family. And this is how they start basically in some kind of fabric. Yes, they do. And I don't know, some kind of bread or something like this. Yes, a couple of women basically just get infected. And I'm assuming 12 or 14 uh, women just uh, people just run away infected and this is how it started great fucking amazing startup of the episode basically later this ellie character she a little bit she's a little bit on the edge i don't love her like this joey character but i like her okay she is this kind of brat wild child and she's cursing to be like i said i don't like those kind of characters but she's likable okay uh, she reminds me of Resident Evil, those fucking Charles, but 100 times better, if that makes sense, yes? In Resident Evil series, yes, this new one, those children, those fucking teenagers, they annoy me as fuck. She doesn't annoy me. She She's right on the edge, like, okay, I like you, I like you. You are fucking wild child, you are cursing, you are this, but I, I like your character, I like your act. So, basically... She was sleeping, she just wake up, and she just saw Joey, and Joey just pointed gun, yes, at her, like, hey, leave me alone, you infected bitch, and she was like, hey, I am not infected, you know, and they have the discussion with the wife, I knew the wife gonna die, check out my review of the Furious episode, my thoughts, I told you guys, she's dead, this fucking wife, and she just died, and it was fucking great scene, amazing scene at the end of the episode, yes, you watched this stuff, so basically, they were discussing like, okay, we, we must take her. And this wife were, was like, okay, why you are fucking, you know, so uh, negative. And the whole episode, and basically she just died. That was fucking sad. So 
you know, the wife was like, we, we're going to take you. And she was eating sandwich. You, you can see, I, I remember some fucking stuff from this episode. Great, amazing stuff, guys. We must appreciate good fucking storytelling. And this is something different. So, basically, you know, they were talking like, okay, we're going to take you. And she was asking, do you give me a gun? And they were like, not. They just give her, yes, the, this book because she was taking a shit. I like, like, this is very realistic take, okay? Like, they are real kind of characters, if that makes sense. Yes, they are people. Like, okay, you got book, you know, to shit or something. Like, you get it there? There are little touches like this. Like, okay, this is like real life shit, yes? So, basically, they were walking through the destroyed city. I love those shots, guys, of the destroyed city. Great fucking CGI, okay? We must appreciate this. Great music choices. Through the whole episode, you just feel tension. You don't know what is going to happen. Right here, this is from this episode. Look at those buildings. Everything looks colorful. Everything looks great. Shadows. Great cinematography. It's simple shots, but looks cinematic. Okay? Uh, so, basically, you know, they were walking around and they were, you know, have the dialogue. Yes, this uh, Ellie with this guy, like, uh, about zombies. And they basically are connected, like... If one zombie here, right here, they can connect it like the mushrooms, basically, yes, to another side of the city or something like this. And you can awake a couple of zombies or maybe whole city of zombies. So th that's a good fucking exposition, okay? Like the character just told another character what is going on. And okay, I know what is going on. The viewer. So great, great stuff. So they are walking around the building. This water, yes. And I was thinking they're gonna do the alien stuff, like the water and the water are gonna be some fucking zombie. No. And the water basically, <laughs> uh, she was telling like, whoa, this is disgusting. I can't swim. So I'm assuming this is gonna come out later again. Yes, in the next episodes. Like this Ellie character can't, can't swim. So this is interesting. So basically, this Ellie character just walks this and makes some noises through the water and just discover the body. And that was fucking like, Okay, this is a little bit scary. They were walking around and she was a little bit making noises and the building was basically they just build up the tension, okay? The building just falling down. They just walking in silence, silence, and as you can feel there are good on building tension in this series, like I said. So they are walking and the zombies just two zombies, yes, and they are not seeing stuff. This is interesting to me. They just hearing stuff. So I am like yeah, you can throw some shit on the another direction and just run. <laughs> no, I have in this mind like just throw a fucking rock in the different direction and just you know destroy the glass and the zombie gonna run over the destroyed glass and you can go in the different direction. I'd be like, just throw fucking stuff in the different direction, just walk slowly. You get it, the idea? I'm that kind of guy, <laughs> but whatever. So the zombies looks amazing, guys. I'm assuming this is some kind of practical effects or something like that. The zombies looks amazing, guys. Seriously. Like mushroom fucking people. And basically, you know, they got attacked, yes. And I'm assuming this wife, yes, of Joey get bitten. And it was like, holy fuck. And this action scenes, yes. Because they just get split up. And uh, we got great action scenes. Two zombies, basically, yes. And the Joey just tried to... You know, shoot the zombies, of course, they just run away. She was hiding, yes, right here. She don't have gun. I'm assuming she's going to have gun later, yes? It's a commentary about children having a gun, yes, in this series. Stupid joke. So, basically, <laughs> uh, you have a right to have a gun, even if you are children, yes? if, even if you are 40. Basically, the Joey character, yes, just uh, kill one zombie and just hide, yes? And it was good tension, like he was standing around this wall and behind this wall it was fucking Mushroom Man, yes? And he was pointing the fucking, you know, this light, yes? And later he just crew to the alley and they just run away and basically he just killed, yes, the zombie and this chick just stabbed the zombie and the guy just killed him, yes, this Joel character. And I'm assuming in this action she get bitten and it was like, what the fuck? So it was Ellie's fault, basically, that this woman died. Yes? <laughs> I don't know if she, she make a noise, but whatever. 
So basically, you know, they just go through the building and right here, this is the shadiest. They are walking through the one building to another and very realistic. Like she, you know, the joy was, hey, if she get infected because she got scarred, yes, once again. Maybe she not gonna be infected. This is from the Fears ep this is from this episode. They were walking around those, those stairs and the set designs looks amazing. It looks fucking great. I love those dynamics. I am gonna I knew already like they're gonna build up this dynamic and I love this stuff. So basically she was walking around through the building and this wife just talking to the Joey because she was broken ankle, yes. To fight the, with fighting the zombies. Right here, yes. This is the action I and basically, uh, she was like, why you are so fucking negative, you know? Just, maybe we're gonna make it, maybe we're gonna blah, blah, blah. You know, that kind of situation. And they were walking around and they have good dialogues. I love the dialogue too. Like, they just came to the building and they just saw those, uh, those zombies, yes? In the previous fucking stuff, yes? Before the action. Basically, they just saw you know 20 or 30 zombies and i love this stuff like they have a little bit dialogue like hey where are we from okay we are detroit i know where is detroit <laughs> i walk to the school great dialogue i can remember stuff like i said so they build in the relationship already yes. and basically you know this girl just open window and they just go and this came out very cool in the circle yes at the end of the episode those zombies like they are seen Basically, they just threw, yes, go at the end of the episode to chase them. And basically, they just go, yes, kill those zombies. They just go to the uh, point like they have to meet the, those people who must take this Ellie, yes, character. And this Ellie character, they just discover this Joey, you know, walking. It's very tense, very tense. Not much, you know, how to say, scary music, but it's very tense. They very good to build in a fucking tension like i said so he just discovered dead bodies there's humans yes and they just go to the museum and basically they have talked like hey what happened to those people and those fucking soldiers killed them those fedra or something like this no uh, one of them get infected or something like this yes. and basically sh they just discover yes this early character like oh holy shit she got bitten and she just get bitten, yes, this wife of this Joey character. And I love those characters already. Seriously, I love those relationships. I cannot wait to the next episode. So, uh, she was taking, talking, you know, like, look at her arms. Her arms, she don't have basically infected, yes, she's not infected. Uh, she is the cure or something like this, yes. And the Joey was very scared of, of her, yes. She, he was taking distance and... He, I like the dialogue, very emotional, like, because they just wake up, basically, yes, because Joey just killed some mushroom men, and another zombies just run through, through the museum, yes, you watch that, so. basically, this uh, very emotional talk, like, you know, this wife, like, hey, promise me, like, you're gonna take care of her, yes, and you're gonna basically take to, to, to those people, yes, because he's, she's the cure or something like this, yes and very emotional scene like she just you know threw those fucking gasoline yes on the fucking floor and grenades and she was blue and set up yes and just run run because one minute and they're gonna basically yes the zombies just came through and the zombies just came through and it was very disturbing scene like uh basically i remember the scene very fucking good Basically, yes, the zombie just run away f through this museum and she tried to basically light up, yes, this fire, the gasoline, yes, on the floor and the zombie just spat her and the zombie just kissed her. It was fucking disturbing and she was at the last moment, she was crying. It was like, holy fuck. And she, she just put the fire on the last and she just blew up on the last second and she just blew up the fucking museum. Yes, you watched that episode. So, and the end of the episode, and great stuff, seriously, great fucking stuff, guys, this is some good level writing, guys, good level storytelling, 8 out of 10, this is great, I love the designs, I love the CGI, I love the acting, I love those characters already, 
and I love this universe. Very realistic, very brutal. This is the shadows. Look at this. This looks beautiful, guys. They are walking right here, yes, through these buildings, and she just broke her ankle, and she was talking to Joey right here, yes. Why you are so fucking negative? Just maybe we're gonna make it or something like this, yes. Great writing, great acting. I cannot wait to the next episode. Eight out of ten. If this is gonna keep up, I'm gonna bump this series to the night or maybe fucking ten out of ten because this is fucking great shit. Like I said, this Ellie character, she, I like more Joey than Ellie, but she doesn't annoy me. Okay, she is this kind of white, like I said, you know, cursing. We, I am, you know, this stupid child, but I like her, and somehow they make her likable and i don't like those kind of like i said characters but she's fucking likable i like her acting i like those this pedro pascal is fucking i love this guy so yeah eight out of ten great stuff i cannot wait like i said great cgi of the mushrooms great story there and i knew this woman gonna die and i am assuming this gonna die too he gonna die too uh, i don't know if we're gonna see 8 out of 10, thank you for watching, okay, this video, subscribe, of course, see you on to another one, bye guys.